Hey everybody, it's a beautiful day outside today. Welcome back to the channel. My name is David and I am Thank you so much. Well, as you can see, I just made a run for the border. And on Monday, Taco Bell is dropping five brand new cantina items. They've got a cantina chicken burrito, a soft taco, a bowl, and then if you are a rewards member on the app, there's a little section on there called, or, called labeled early access go in there and you can get the other two items right now early and that is a cantina chicken crispy taco and a cantina chicken quesadilla so those are available everything drops on monday so if you're watching this video when i post it tomorrow on sunday you can get those two items a day early uh, i meant to get that out a little bit earlier but things happened and i just couldn't do it so these two items are pretty basic the crispy taco only has chicken and cheese on it the quesadilla is the same way chicken and cheese only but it comes with two dipping sauces so i guess that's probably why they made those early access they already had you know the tortillas and the shells all they had to worry about was the chicken because the burritos and the soft taco they look like they're a whole lot more dressed up it almost looks like it has slaw on it or something like that i'm on the way home now can't wait to see what these taste like and i'll see you there Welcome back guys. As you can see, I got my bag here and before I dig in, when you go on the app and you're looking and you're ordering these items, both of them were supposed to come with a packet of sauce. Let me see if that's in here. Well, let's see. Yes, they did come with a packet of sauce and it is like a salsa verde. So it should be like a green sauce. So I didn't ask for any uh, taco sauce or anything like this. This, is, this should suffice. So this will be the taco. And this is the fajita, I'm assuming. Although it's in a pizza box. The fajitas usually come in a flat bag. I'm a little concerned here because, let me check the fajita box real quick. Okay. All right. So what they've done is they've just folded it over and put it in there. Now, the default for what this comes with is guacamole and low fat sour cream. I was able to swap them out on the app. They have plenty of choices to go with. And I went with a chipotle sauce. They also have like a spicy ranch. And that was the other thing that it came with was low fat sour cream. So I replaced it with the cheese sauce. And let's see what else did they have. They had a chipotle sauce, which I got. Then they had a, I want to say an avocado sauce, maybe spicy ranch. And maybe one other, but they've, they've got plenty to choose from. So keep that in mind if you're ordering at the window that there are default sauces it comes with, but you have other ones available that you can switch them out for. So let's take a look at the taco. That's what I'm going to start with. Okay, so it's on a normal taco shell. It's a little bit greasy. Uh, for some reason, there's the reason for the grease. There's cheese on the outside of it. Cheddar cheese is always greasy. So let's see, cheese on the outside, and chicken and cheese on the inside. So it's plenty cheesy. I'm going to try it without the sauce first, and then I'll add the sauce a few bites in. Cheers.
Okay, there's the sauce. That stuff almost looks like it's nuclear. Let's see how it tastes. That sauce is good. <clears throat> I like it. Definitely helped that taco. The taco was, was not bad at first. A little dry because it didn't have anything liquidy on it. Or even any sour cream or anything to to help it out. Flavor was fine though. It was just, I mean, just a little dry. But yeah, I like it. Uh, that was $2.99. That taco right there. This is $6.59 of course. That's in the Middle Tennessee market. So... Of course, wherever you're at it, you know, it may be more expensive. But for $3, it's not a bad taco. I, I'd get that again. Definitely. And I thought about, when I opened it up, I thought about pulling off one of the pieces of chicken to see how they tasted by themselves. But then I decided against it because I'm going to do the bowl as well. And that's just going to, that's going to have the chicken in there all plain with no cheese or nothing on it. So I'll get a true taste of what it felt. A <laughs> true feel for what it tastes like. On to the quesadilla. Now this looks, I can't tell if that's their normal size quesadilla. I'd never get them. If Blake was here, I'd ask him. But he would know for sure. He gets quesadillas all the time. But it looks to have a pretty good amount of chicken in it. So for six and a half dollars, think about it. I mean, it's got chicken and cheese and a tortilla. It's basically the same thing as what I just ate. It's just a little bit bigger of a tortilla and it's not a, you know, it's not fried or whatever it turned into a shell. So there's definitely more profit margin in this. That is the, uh, the chipotle, the creamy chipotle sauce. And this is their cheese sauce that comes with all their nachos and stuff. Not a big fan of that, but I figured I'd, I had to get something, nothing else really thought about the spicy ranch, but then I was like, you know, if I got spicy ranch and this has kick to it, I wouldn't be able to tell where the kick is coming from. Kind of like with the, with the first one, I was not sure if the kick that I was getting, because there's a slight kick to it, was coming from the actual chicken or if it was the sauce I put on there. So that one's kind of flat, but yeah, these things don't do well once they've... <laughs> Once they've gotten, once they've sat a little bit. So there's hardly any chicken in there at all. So I definitely don't want to pick any out. Let's try it by itself first. Okay, here's my thoughts on this. Excellent, I love it. It was great just by itself. I really, especially that first bite of that second one with a little bit more chicken in it, that was excellent. The sauces, they're, they're fine too. I mean, they, uh, I'm a dipper, so I was more than happy to try the sauces. This is excellent. I really like it. I wish they bottled it. They, hell, they might already bottle it and sell it in the store somewhere. I would get this for home use. Uh, this is just the, the plain old cheese sauce that you get at any with any nachos. The quesadilla tasted fine with both of them on it. The only thing is with the sauces on it, they're 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 really really flavorful. So. They kind of overpower and it kind of masks the flavor of the quesadilla. So for me, I would prefer the quesadilla just by itself without the sauces on it. Which one do I like better of the two? This, definitely. 
I've always been more of a of a soft shell lover more than the crispy. I like the crispy just fine, and I, and I want at least one crunchy taco with my meal, of, or crunchy something of some sort. But I've always I've always liked the soft better. But I think the, the flavor is just better on it. That's a little messy. If it, I don't know if you saw that, but at the end. I had stuff on every single one of my fingers, plus it had dripped down onto that thing. If I'd have been in my car, it'd have been everywhere. Anyway, that's it for this one, guys. I've got, uh, this will be posted tomorrow, which will be Sunday the 17th, St. Patty's Day. Happy St. Patty's Day to you. Be safe if you go out drinking. Um, and then on Tuesday, I will do haven't decided which order I'm going to do them in, but I'm going to do the soft taco and the burrito on one day and the bowl on the other. So those two separate videos will be posted on Tuesday and Thursday respectively. So be on the lookout for those. Again, these all drop on every, all five items drop on Monday, at least in my area on the app where I was picking up on it. It said that they're available on 318. So that's Monday. So if you're watching and you want to try these early, you know, tomorrow, pull out your app. If you don't have it, download it, become a rewards member, and you'll have access to them. And then if not, just wait till Monday and everything will be available then. But have a great rest of the day, guys, and enjoy your St. Patrick's Day. Be safe, and we'll see you in the next video.